I'm a dreamer I've been thinking about the world disappear I've been seeing blue and gold This is real Hello everyone, welcome back to LEGO Times 3. Today we're reviewing the LEGO Avengers Thanos Mech 76141. It has 152 pieces, including one Thanos minifigure. It was released in 2020 and it retails for $9.99. And the thing about this one is that it comes with a minifigure of Thanos, which before we've only got a big figure of Thanos. And I'm really liking the art of the box and including the back I think it looks really cool and I've been impressed with the mech designs for the box so far here we have the final build and right off the bat I think it looks really cool this is the front side he stands really good and here's the back the back like the other mechs is plain uh, compared to the front side but overall I think it looks really cool and just considering that Thanos is a big a big guy uh, when you first look at this mech uh, you could also consider that maybe the mech is his body and you could just pose him as if he is a big guy rather than pretending he's inside of a suit which doesn't really make a lot of sense that Thanos would be in a mech suit but you could pretend that this is an extension of him and it could be his body if you want to pretend that his chest piece is printed so that's always good to get printed pieces and it looks really cool there were stickers in here but it was very little compared to the other mechs uh, they were just on his arms and the side of his legs right there. Uh, not a big deal. They were very easy to put on and overall I think it looks cool. Not too many stickers. One of the main highlights in sight this mech is his like gauntlet hand. And I think this was done really cool. And you don't get like the infinity stones that you get in other sets but you do get these like circle colored pieces that you could easily just pretend that they're the infinity stones too and I think it looks cool it looks fine the fingers move really good and you can make some really cool poses with this glove and I'm glad that they made it bigger than the other hand it really shows that it's supposed to be his glove and I feel like Thanos' uh, glove with the Infinity Stones is a big part and should be a big part of his mech. Here's the bottom of his feet, nothing special like the Iron Man ones where you had to see his like repulsors that let him fly. Uh, Thanos' feet are uh, plain, but I do like how they make the top of his feet. Uh, you do get gold pieces in here. and. I think it's always cool to get more cool pieces. And something else I want to mention that I think should be obvious is if you want your Thanos to be without his helmet, you could just easily take that helmet off like that. And he could be like a like a bald Thanos inside the mech. And I think he still looks just as cool. And the way you would put Thanos in here is by opening his chest piece like that, like the other mechs, and there's a little black piece right there that goes in between his legs there's no stud that holds him but he just slips right on in there and he's held pretty good and you close that and he won't be falling now he's pretty secure here is the Thanos minifigure and his front torso has a lot of detail and so do his legs and I think that looks really nice I think it came out really cool uh, as for his helmet I'm not sure I'm loving it all that much, but for what it is, I think it looks really cool. But uh, I think Thanos doesn't translate really well as a small figure, but I do think this one looks nice. And here's his back torso. Also, a lot of detail looks really good in my opinion. As for a second face, 
he has no second phase, just uh, plain, which you could look at it as, as a good thing, because then you could just have a Thanos without a helmet, and I think he still looks really cool. For a set of $10, I'd say it's worth getting, and it's really cool mech, and like I said earlier, I would pretend it's more of an extension of Thanos, uh, rather than an actual mech for Thanos. But I do recommend it if you can get it for yourself. I want to thank you guys for watching this review. And if you haven't seen our previous mech reviews, I'll put them in the description below. And I want to thank you guys once again for watching our channel, LEGO Times 3. I'm a dreamer. I've been thinking about the world disappear. I've been seeing blue and gold. This is real. Heavy heart I see